What's up everybody, this is Cameron Wells at Capital City Motorsports Park and welcome to the Capital City Motorsports Park YouTube page. This is going to be a recap page and also to let you know what is coming up in the future, any big announcements, anything like that. So um, today we're going to discuss the King of the Mountain series, who won at the last race and what's coming up next and the point series. So uh, let's go ahead and get into it. The Saturday Super Pro winner was Nakia Downham and now I'm not good with names so Nakia Downham is how I'm going to guess you pronounce that. The uh, foot break winner for Saturday was Jennifer Varner. The Saturday 6-9 to nine junior winner was Jesse Varner. And Saturday 10-up winner was Miss Felicity Morris. Yeah, she, they all did very well Saturday. Then su the Sunday Super Pro winner was Gat Gatwood. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Gat Gatwood. Uh, the Sunday foot break winner was Rick Justice. The Sunday 6-9 to nine winner was also Jesse Varner. He doubled up. That was... That kid was extremely good. And the uh, Sunday 10 and up winner was Mr. Carson Emmett. Carson Emmett did very well on Sunday. Then uh, now for the points. The Super Bowl points leader is Owen Millerbrooks. Owen Millerbrooks, he is leading the Super Bowl points for the King of the Mountain series. The uh, foot break points leader is Mark Broderick. Broderick, I believe that's how you say that, Broderick. Um... Then the six to nine points leader is Reese Noah. Reese Noah is leading. And then the 10 and up points leader is Carson Emmett. And I believe he is leading by possibly one round if, or two rounds, if I'm not mistaken. Now, the next King of the Mountain Series race is going to be June the 11th through the 13th. That will be the next race at Capital C Motorsports Park. But now this weekend, we got some big stuff coming up on May 28th this Friday. Let's start with Wednesday. Um, Wednesday, we are going to have our normal test and tune. One lane will be prepped for slicks, and the other lane will be prepped for radials. So come out, do some testing, get it all tuned up and ready to go. Coming up Friday, May 28th, we're going to have the quarter mile street battle. About what it sounds like. You got to drive it in the gate. It's going to be on a pro tree, full stock interior, and uh, DOT approved tires. And if you want to see the rest of the rules and the flyer itself, Go and check out the Capital City Motorsports Park Facebook page. That It's just going to be Capital City Motorsports Park. Go and look at that in Facebook. It's going to have all of your other information. And um, this it that's going to be a $500 to win. Free entry with a test and tune tech card. You have to purchase a test and tune tech card to get the free entry. Then uh, coming up that Saturday... May 29th, we got the Freedom Saturday Bracket Race. Super Pro is going to be paying $5,000 to the winner. The Foot Break winner will be getting $1,000. Six to nine juniors will be getting $150. And 10 and up will get $500 to win. And the thing about the juniors, this is going to be a two race in one day. We're going to run, the we're going to run out the first race, and then we're going to start a second race. So if you lose the first one, don't worry, get in the second one. Then, coming up on that this Sunday, this is going to be a big event. This is going to be something you do not want to miss, especially if you like fast cars. Mr. Edmund, <clears throat> excuse me, Mr. Edmund Hall, Mr. Five Speed himself, will be coming to Capital City Motorsports Park. Him and his pro my guys are going to be coming. They're going to have about uh, six classes. Going to have 430s, 470, 530, 6 flat, 7 flat, and 8 flat, or 6070 and 80, depending on how you say it. But uh, he is going to come out. They're going to put on a great Pro Mod show. You're not going to want to miss it. And they will be testing that Saturday, I believe. I think some of them will be there testing. So come out this weekend. Catch all your racing action at Capital C Motorsports Park. Um, we are the new owners at Capital C Motorsports Park, formerly known as Montgomery Raceway Park or Montgomery Motorsports Park. It's been both. We're just excited to see everybody coming out. We're going to make this track back to what it originally was. And um, one other thing about the junior drafters, we are NHRA sanctioned, which means if you are 6 to 9 years old, you are not allowed to run faster than 1190. If you are 10 to 12 years old, you're not allowed to run any faster than 890. And 790, of course, for the 10 and up, for the uh, 13 and up, excuse me. 13 to 18, you are not allowed to run faster then 790. So uh, that's the main rules for that. And then uh, foot brake, the rules are you cannot leave off of the trans brake. We are a foot brake track. Um, no trans brakes allowed. 
But uh, that's pretty much going to be it for the rules, and I believe that'll be it for this video. So go and check us out on Facebook and TikTok. TikTok, I believe, is CCMP underscore 660. And the Facebook page is Capital City Motorsports Park. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. And we'll see everybody this weekend and every other weekend at Capital City Motorsports Park.